Hello guys, welcome to another Spigot plugin tutorial and today it's on Ghosty. So this plugin was recommended by uh, Deluxe Nation HD and uh, it's quite a cool plugin so I'm going to join my server now and as you can see I am sort of transparent and uh, you can't actually see me. So this is great for um, servers with either multiple um, worlds or multiple servers that have mini games. So <clears throat> there isn't that much lag when you join uh, the service because I know uh, some big servers still have a problem where there's like a hundred players in the hub and it just lags uh, people with um, not as good PCs. So um, you can set in the config that um, you are default a ghost on join. Uh, you can s set it to disable worlds as well and change the messages. So that's pretty cool. So the main command is ghost ghosty and uh, this shows you two commands so you can obviously see the ver version uh, so let's look at that and it's 1.0 so it's pretty new and you can reload the configs as well uh, so that's pretty cool um, so I might do that in a second and um, if you for slash ghost um, plus a player's name um, not your own though so say Lincoln Park if he was on uh, that would make him a ghost or stop him from being a ghost um, but if you want to change yourself um, from not being invisible, you just do forward slash ghost and you're normal again, everyone can see you and you can do the command again and now you're invisible. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, um, uh, quite a small plugin, um, very useful nonetheless. And yeah, I'm just going to uh, find the config here, uh, edit something quickly and then do the uh, reload. So yeah. Um, What's this? Ghost, ghosty reload configs. Uh, I'll, I'll just change maybe a color or something. Um, change this to dark blue. Why not? There we go. So save that and yes. So save, reload the config, and if I do process ghost, it's in dark blue now. So yeah, uh, really customizable plugin. Looks really awesome. And yeah, down the link below. Uh, subscribe, like, comment, and tell me what plugin you want to see next. So uh, I think this guy commented a few hours ago, and I've already done the plugin. So that's that's good for me. Usually it takes me a month or two to get a plugin reviewed. So yeah.